I see a very large building where Muslims have all gathered for worship, collapsing and sinking down into its foundations. Collapsing and sinking down into its foundations. Sinking and killing many with it, like in the days of Samson, when the Lord used his fingers to bring down the Dagon idol temple, killing hundreds of thousands of, of Philistines present in it. But the difference here is no one shall be able to determine what really has caused the sudden mega collapse and sinking and sinking. Only ideas and guesswork will be thought of. Even when scientists claim to come up with something, or even when those who were around the scenario claim to come up with something, they will not really come up with something tangible. It will be a mystery. Let me put it that way. This could happen anywhere in the world, but let's commit especially the Mecca Center into God's mercy too, so that wherever this is destined to happen, may the Lord's mercy speak for them as an infallible sign of God's love is physically shown to them all in the scene. To heroically come to the light Jesus Christ, blessed be God forever. I spoke about this Mecca center of fire and I pray so intensely because I know the amount of people who are so much cramped when they go there for their worship. Yes, I am a Christian, they are Muslim, but everyone is created to the image and likeness of God. So as a Christian, I have no right to judge. If I judge, who will judge me on the last day. So I pray so intensely against the fire and Satan strategized a plan. And the Lord showed me Satan strategized another way and brought water or whatsoever or insect or whatsoever. But this one is disastrous. Because I see people cram there because when people go there for worship, they are like ants. Ants being videotaped from, from above or being videotaped from a distance. So I see people going down. I see the foundation of that maker center going down. And you can imagine how many people will sink with it. And the Lord said this is not only about the Mecca Center, other centers of worship. When it comes to Islam and Muslims all over the world, they should wash and pray. The Lord will show them mercy.